Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a deck review. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's a new week. It is a new week. Welcome. Hope you had a great weekend. Did you have a great weekend? I hope you're staying safe, staying healthy, having fun, playing with playing cards, doing magic tricks, doing all the things that I love. If you don't know, Magic Orthodoxy, I am a hobbyist magician. Hobby magician, I perform uh, magic, uh, well, online, right? <laughs> I perform magic online both here on YouTube and over on my TikTok channel. There's original content over there. You might want to go check it out. Uh, I perform for friends and family and people in my neighborhood. And I also have this little channel here where I review the latest and the greatest, both playing cards and magic tricks every single week. If you like that kind of thing, hit like, hit subscribe, hit the clickety click, do all the pushy push that you know how to do. Thanks. Today we're looking at the Bosch transformation deck. This is a puzzle deck as well. So great. A lot of awesome things in this. I want to talk all about it. This is from my buddy Sunish Chaba. Uh, it was a Kickstarter and of course successfully funded. And this is the deck in my hot little hands. And you can uh, follow Sunish online and find out where these cards are for sale. Probably anywhere quality playing cards are sold. So I mentioned that this is a transformation deck. It is, but it's so much more. A transformation deck is usually where you incorporate the pips and indices into the picture, but this deck is also a 54 piece magical puzzle. Every single card is a self-contained picture, but when you lay all the cards out in a specific sequence, it transforms the entire deck into a single large artwork masterpiece. Uh, the Bosch Collector's Edition deck is inspired and based on the works of the first surrealist painter in the world, modern artist Heronius Bosch. And like I said, this deck is much more than just a deck of cards. It is also a work of art divided into 54 unique and individual pieces of works of art that bring Heronius Bosch's works of art and his entire universe to life. The back design has a black border that isn't a hard line. It's just made up of the art that surrounds it. You have a bunch of what looks like orangey tulips with almost like a pomegranate shape there in the center. And you have four owls peeking out from the holes in the center. The cards also feature an augmented reality that will transport you back to the 15th century artwork of Hieronius Bosch. There's an app available on both Apple and Android, and you can see this little video demo that'll show you how to do it. Going through the face cards, you're gonna see just how unique each individual card is, because this deck is combining what we all know about a transformation deck, where the suit and the pips interact with the elements that are integrated with it, but it also takes on the nature of a puzzle deck and uh, all the dynamism of the characters is accentuated by their connection with those depicted in their card plus the cards that are connected to it. So the Bosch deck is not only a deck of fine art playing cards, but it becomes this beautiful magical puzzle too. And when placed together in the right sequence, the entire deck of 54 cards transforms into a single large masterpiece, which probably or absolutely would be great for framing. So I think this is a perfect gift for families or gatherings or parties, collectors, uh, anybody who loves either Heronius Bosch's artwork or just collecting really unique decks. Lastly, I would say this is probably not a deck of cards you're going to do magic with or play games with, right? So I'm not really going to do weights and measurements for this, but I will say they are printed by the Legends Playing Card Company on their classic finish and they do come with performance coating. All right, that's everything I can say about the Bosch Puzzle Playing Cards. I wanna thank Sunish Chaba for allowing me to have this deck so that I could do the review for you. And if you would like to find them for yourself, I would highly recommend uh, reaching out to Sunish and following his social media links. Thanks guys, I'll see you next time, bye. But wait, do you wanna learn more about the t-shirt I was wearing in today's video? Of course you do. That's from my Teespring store. If you scroll down into the description area, you can click any one of those t-shirt graphics. It'll take you out to Teespring and show you my magic orthodoxy apparel. That's right. I've got several different styles and colors and price points to choose from, including my king of clubs 
Black Roses exclusive Daniel Schneider tea. If you appreciate what I do, that is a great way to support this channel. Thanks.